Hey everyone, welcome to MOVFX and in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create this type of simple looking text animation which is actually a kind of a brush stroke. So let's see how to create this by using Blackmagic Fusion. So first of all, we have to take a new composition. So go to file menu and click on new and take a new composition after that let's check our composition settings so go to file menu again and click on preferences and here is frame format so this composition is 1920 into 1080 and 30 frame per second and then click on save after that let's convert this composition into 300 frame which is equal to 10 seconds so put the value 300 and hit enter now let's uh, take a text plus node so click on text plus button here and then right click on flow window and go to arrange tool and check this box to turn on the grid snap okay now drag it to the viewer and click on window layout one for single view and click on fit and type a text whatever you want to type but i am typing romantic and change font style to blues and bloom you can download this font from link given in the description uh, but uh, let me tell you this font is free only for personal use not for commercial so anyway uh, let's increase the size of this font so put the value 0 0.15 and hit enter okay it's good and now increase the size of this preview window and take a background node so click on bg button here and select this background node and press f2 and rename it to p underscore one okay now select this node and press shift plus a space bar for search box and search for paint node so this is our paint node click on ok and drag it to the viewer after that select these two nodes and place it over here and take a merge node now connect this yellow point to this text and green point to this paint node and drag it to the viewer after that select this p1 background node and make this alpha 0 okay after that select this paint node double click on that and click on this option here polyline and create path according to this text something like this let's change this color for better visibility so pick a color like uh, this and click on ok ok now it's good ok now for second one so just reverse this path like this and I start from here now for third one start from here something like this okay now for next one so rotate it from here now for last one so okay now double click on paint node and expand this brush control and decrease the softness of this brush okay so increase the brush size something like this okay now it's good after that select this merge node and Come to operator option and change this over to in okay now select this paint tool and minimize this brush control and pick color white okay and now double click on this paint node minimize this apply controls and expand this stroke control and go to frame approx uh, 120 frame and right click on this option and click on animate and go to frame 0 
and hold this slider and make this value 0 now let's check this okay it's looking something like this okay after that let's import a brush stroke so go to folder and here is brush a png file so i have given a link in the description so download this brush and drag and drop to the flow window uh, now let's take uh, another background node so click on bg button and rename this background to p underscore 2 okay now select this and press shift plus a space bar and search for paint and click on ok and drag it to the viewer now select this p2 and make this alpha 0 okay now take a merge node so double click on flow window and click on merge button and let's connect this yellow point to this brush and green point to this paint and drag it to the viewer and select this brush png file and go to properties of this brush and here is import option so click on this and check this option post multiply by alpha after that select this paint node and here is polyline stroke so click on this option okay after that press ctrl and scroll down for zoom out and create a stroke something like this so change this color okay okay now select this paint node x and expand this brush control and decrease the softness of this brush like show and increase the size of this brush okay now minimize this brush control and change this color to white and minimize this apply control and expand this stroke control go to frame 120 and right click here and click on animate and go to frame 100 and hold this slider and make this value 0 okay now double click on this merge 2 and go to properties of this merge and here is operator option so change this over to in okay now let's check this okay it's looking something like that okay now select all these four nodes and place it over here so select these four nodes and go to tool menu flow and click on underlay press ctrl and deselect these four nodes and right click on this rename it to text okay right click again and set a color something like this okay now create another tile for these four nodes so select this and go to tool menu flow underlay and press ctrl and deselect these four nodes right click on this set a color like this okay and right click again and rename it to brush and hit enter now increase the size of this flow window and take a merge node and connect this yellow point to this and green point to merge to and drag it to the viewer now select this merge to node and click on xf button and take a transform and set this stroke something like this and double click on transform node and go to properties of this and here is use size and aspect so uncheck this option and set this okay it's looking nice okay click on fit so let's play this okay it's looking nice and let's take a uh, another transform node so select this merge and click on xf and press f2 and rename this transform to scale okay now select this scale node and 
go to frame 300 and right click on size click on animate and go to frame 0 and increase the size like 1.25 and hit enter okay now let's import a video footage so go to folder and this is our video footage uh, let me tell you guys this footage is downloaded from pixabay.com and i have given a link in the description so download this from that link and drag and drop to the flow window okay now take a merge node and connect this yellow point to this node and green point to this scale and drag it to the viewer now select this video footage and go to timeline press f4 for full screen and press ctrl and scroll down for zoom out and and slide this loader to something like this okay now press f4 again and go to flow window and select this node and go to tool menu color and take a color corrector node and double click on this color corrector and go to properties of this and here is master rgb gain so decrease the value like 0 0.8 and decrease the value of rgb lift something like minus 0 0.2 okay it's looking nice okay after that let's create an aspect ratio so take a, another background so click on bg button rename it to black click on ok select this black node and click on this rectangle option and create a rectangle something like this okay now let's merge this so place it over here and take a merge node connect this green point to this black and yellow point to this merge 4 and drag it to the viewer and select this rectangle tool and here is invert option so check this option okay after that go to spline window press f4 on the keyboard for full screen click on one and click on this option here and select these keyframes press f for flatten and now check paint 2 and select these keyframes press f and now check this skill and click on this option select these keyframes press f on the keyboard for flatten press f4 for, for exit and go to flow window okay now it's done so let's check this it's looking awesome and that's all for this tutorial i hope you like it and i will see you next tutorial till then bye bye